What's up guys, Simplistic here, back with another video. If you couldn't tell from the title, it is another Delta 8 and Delta 10 video. But before we get started, I do realize that Cake has been a brand that's been faked and uh, copied a lot. I went through Reddit, I've seen a lot of these accusations and stuff against them. And I would like to say right now, I actually have a few ways to actually prove that I got it from the source. First off, is they sent some merch with it. And it actually has like Cake on the the collar or the back which is usually you know if they do fake merch they have like a company um, like fruit of the loom or whatever and then they edit or put their thing on here but this is their shirt this is their sweater and their sweater even has it as well so I mean if that's I don't know if that's proof enough but you know for a company that's faked I don't think people would bother even doing merch but then again, I don't really know too much about it. And also, they sent me posters. I'm, I don't know what I'm going to do with these posters. Obviously, I'm not going to just hang them around my room because it just says cake. But the fact that they sent me posters is just in itself. Just, I can't even open this fucking thing. Okay. So, look at how many posters they sent. All colors. I don't and they just say cake on here. I don't really want to open it. It's just hella in here. Another problem that I found out with these cake carts is that the hardware tends to lead contaminations in terms of lead and all that stuff. So basically the hardware was bad. But these bad boys, the ones that were sent to me, these hardwares and stuff, they were actually made by DabX. So that fixes that problem. Another problem is that they didn't have third party testing. Uh, there is a QR code right here and I did check them. They actually don't go to a specific website, but they take you to a download where you can download the COAs and stuff. Um, unfortunately, it only shows one page for each thing. I would, usually I would like to have a few more pages, you know, um, more information and stuff. But, you know, it is what it is. I do trust these guys because DabX did make it. So, right off the bat, it takes me to, right here, I'm going to click it. I actually downloaded some already, so you're going to see me actually... Um, it says right here, I downloaded like, how many of them already? Oh wait, I didn't. It says you want to download again. They're all named the same, but uh, let's see. The one I scanned was the purple one, I believe. So you can see right here, the purple one. And let's just see the date that they did this. Report issue date. Like I said, I would usually like more than just one page of the COAs, but since I trust these guys, I'm uh, giving them the benefit of the doubt. And uh, like I said, I did scan this. Uh, I don't need to scan this one. Let me scan it. So. And yeah, the title of this video is Trying Cake Delta 8 and Delta 10 Cartridges or Disposables. And we're just going to... Right there. Yeah, and then click on this. And it's going to take you to a download. Download that again. So this one is the ice cream cake. So this one's going to have the picture of the ice cream cake right there. See that? The date was on the... Right here. That's when they did that. Hopefully you can see. There we go. Enough talking. Let's get started. Let's open some of these. Uh, also, there is a QR code right here. I did scan it. It just takes me to like a, a website that you can only access through here and it shows all their gummies. So I don't know. Maybe they just use that as a sticker. Um, but let's just show you some of the back stuff that we have here. You can re uh, pause if I'm going too fast. You can even scan it yourself if you don't believe me. Okay? There you go. Alright, so let's try this. Ooh. Authentic product purchase. Oh shit. So there's an authentication. I would like to say that the child proof was pretty easy. I didn't really need to follow the instructions. I just pulled that shit out. But we chilling. We got this. It is a nice little disposable here. Like look at that. That's truly truly a nice piece. Let's just open the other one here. Hopefully they have the Oh shit, so they actually don't have the strain on here, but they do have a USB pass-through charger. That's cool. Every disposable should have that now because no one likes to 
waste oil and if the battery dies before the oil like ends what's the use right so this one right here we're gonna leave this on just so I know it is the ice cream cake and we're gonna open this one here another authentication product all that good stuff Let me try this so let's just uh, actually we're gonna rip off for the purple one we're gonna rip off the paper on the bottom another one so Let's just get a thumbnail of the products itself. Okay, cheers, guys. Hmm. Is there a button? Hmm, I think this may have uh, came without a charger. Or being charged. It's unfortunate. Or maybe you need to pull this off. Okay, I think you need to hold, or you needed to take off the sticker. That's crazy. It might be because there's like a little hole right here. Let's see. And that was blocking it, and that's probably the air hole. Could be wrong, but let's just take a fucking hit. I would like to say that this is very familiar to other Delta 8 and Delta 10 products I've had before. Honestly, um, now that I took the sticker off, I really can't tell other than the taste. Let me see. Oh yeah, this is the white runs. The other one is the ice cream cake. So let's take a double hit. Cheers, guys. <laughs> I would like to say the right white runs one. Wow, that's fruity. Um, the ice cream cake one, not so much um, of t flavor I enjoy. It's not bad. It's just it kind of. It's like that original, like that piney taste. I'm, I'm kind of on and off with that piney taste. Like I've tasted it so much that when I taste it, it's not really surprising or exciting to me. You know, let me just try to. Go. Yeah, this one's way better, <clears throat> but this one is not bad. I would say that if you tend to like more of the the piney, like OG flavors, I would recommend the ice cream cake. But as far as like the fruity flavors go, I would definitely recommend this one. Um, they also do have an Instagram, but I tried to check it. And you guys know when it comes down to Instagram and like cannabis brands and stuff, they're always being deleted. So, um, you know, it is what it is. Hopefully they can get an official Instagram up and hopefully they can get their, their website up and running, you know. But other than that, you know, I really actually I actually I actually really enjoyed this one specifically um, I was kind of like hesitant going into this video because of all the fake cakes and stuff but after the reassurance of the test results um, the authenticity box or whatever the merchandise the posters I honestly think that I was just worried for no reason you know but I would like to say like, I can't stress this enough there are fakes out there so if you do purchase it please do your research, know where to get it, make sure you get it from a legit source, you know, and I can't stress that enough. Like these were actually from the people themselves and this machinery that they had, the Dab X machinery, this shit fucking hits. Uh -huh, I ain't gonna lie, man. Let's take another hit and uh, we're gonna end the video here. Hopefully you enjoyed this video nonetheless. Cheers guys. I also do have another one of their um, cannabinoid products. This one's gonna be HXC. Just them trying to be different in terms of being called HHC or HXC. They're just using the the X in the hexo, hydro, whatever the heck, instead of the hydro. So it's HXC. It's basically the same thing though. And I'm gonna have a video on that as well. Probably, yeah, in a few days or so, I'm just gonna take the hits. 
I'm just gonna enjoy these ones and then probably do that video. But cheers, guys. I don't know if there's blinkers. I don't know if I can do a blinker. Fuck. I'll do five, six seconds. Cheers. Peace out, guys.